My name's Helen Gibson and I'm one of the Joint Managing Directors at Degencia. We're a management consultancy company, so um, I've been involved with the Hull University Business School Master's Programme, particularly supporting management consultancy and analytics. Um, I've also supported a couple of other programmes, but uh, that's been great over a number of years for me, working with a whole range of different students and uh, my role has primarily been to come in and talk to the students. Uh, we've done a number of workshops and for me just to explain a little bit about what life as a management consultant is um, and for the students obviously to have an opportunity to ask all of their questions, find out a bit more and um, so that's been the initial work that I've done. I've also helped out in terms of designing the programme and supporting the curriculum and, and what goes into that and then further on throughout the year actually supporting a number of individual students with their practical projects. <laughs> so uh, we've had a number of students over the years doing a variety of different consultancy projects and that's worked really well for them in terms of getting a bit of practical experience in uh, a consultancy company but it's also been great for us as a business to have a whole range of different young people coming in and uh, for different ideas and uh, things that they've learned specifically from the programme that have, have helped us as a business. Our most recent student that came to work with us was a girl called Hannah and as soon as I met her I sensed her enthusiasm and uh, she immediately said oh it'd be great to do my project with you if at all possible and she actually came from a, a legal background so I think that particularly chimed in terms of some of the work that Agency is doing. So several months down the line we involved her and a particular topic that she was looking at was anti-corruption and the effects that change management may or may not have in the mix in terms of uh, reducing corruption. So she's been involved in doing a whole range of interviews with a number of our team and uh, an awful lot of work that's gone into that project. Got uh, great support from her a uh, lecturer in that particular subject matter. So that's been a really useful uh, project, not only for Agencia, but for, for Hannah as well. And certainly some of those findings are quite practical things that Agencia is able to make use of. Um, and we're also looking at whether it's possible to get some of her findings published as well in some of the academic journals. So it's been a really great project for her and actually off the back of that we've employed Hannah to work with us and um, that's been a temporary role but nonetheless it's allowed her to get some more varied experience in terms of working with us and uh, she's now gone on to get a full-time job uh, in a consultancy company not too far from here. One of the key aspects in terms of some of our work and obviously in terms of the programme itself is the data side of things and getting that evidence base absolutely critical for anything that you're doing. So certainly from what we're doing there's often an input that's either quantitative data or qualitative data or both <laughs> and uh, very much making use of that to inform uh, the direction of strategy strategies or uh, the redesign of services or whatever it might be, it's got to have that firm foundation that is an evidence base.